Let's see if he wants to block. He doesn't. Welcome back, everybody, to the show. I am your host, as always, Jay Villain, aka That Villain Jay. And tonight, we have a very special treat for you. We are coming live from Alchemy Central here in the Black Mountains, where I live. Um, and we are opening Alchemy Packs and taking a look. I have been super excited. The client has been stable, there's been no major glitches. Um, and uh, I'm really enjoying it so far, guys. I wanted to talk about my first impressions and I wanted to get you into these uh, first pack openings that we get and build the deck with everybody. Um, so that's what we're gonna do today, guys. That's what we're gonna do today. First, I need you to do something for me though, if you're new here. And if you're just discovering Magic Arena because of alchemy, you know what you can do for me? Tenderly press that like button, a gently press that subscribe button or else well guys the like and subscribe is going to come and maul you viciously it's a it's a youtube werewolf he gets you for not liking and subscribing uh you can join us on a stream every night at twitch.tv slash that villain j where you can catch all of the live streaming goodness we would love to have you there and of course you can check out our discord community for all the latest news information and decks and of course on top of that my Aether Hub, where all the all the new stuff, all the decks, and my videos are available uh, for your pleasure. So go check all of those in the description. So let's talk about alchemy, guys. First of all, I want to let you know that right here, in case you really are interested, even available through gold, you can get these alchemy boosters. Unfortunately, I spent all my gold and I didn't have time to save up, so I'm going to spend the gems. Why is this different? Well, this is the standard pack bundle, because you can just buy alchemy packs with a very nice looking pack on there, just for the same price that you would buy any other packs, 15 for 300. They're giving you a one-time deal where you can get 20 um, for 300. Rhyme, how you doing? Grimy. We're getting a bunch of new people here tonight because we're streaming early. Uh, th welcome, welcome, welcome all. Welcome one and all. Chat, make them feel very welcome here. Um, so that's what we're doing. So I've already saved up a bunch of packs, which we're going to show you, and I'm going to tell you how I got all these packs, then we're going to open them, then we're going to look into it, and we're going to talk all about the brand new Alchemy system, uh, and what we like, and our first impressions too. Uh, so let's grab these for these gems. One-time purchase. Yes, you can grind to them, guys. It is absolutely worth it. Uh, for three free packs, how long will it take you? Well, guess you usually get about maybe... 1,000 to 1,500 packs a day. I mean, gold a day. 1,000 to 1,500 uh, gold a day. It should only take you about... Mm, any... any. Really, it's more like if you get your five wins, it's more like 1,800 gold a day on average. Should only take you about 15 days. Maybe a little bit more, maybe less. But for 20 packs... Oh, Tectonic coming in with the gifted subs. Look at that. Um... Uh, thank you for everybody subscribing. Come join the villains today. Uh, look at all these people subscribing. Tectonic coming in with a big win. Hit that hype. Um, so it is worth it to grind to that, guys. Absolutely it is. In case you're wondering, spend the 15 uh, spend the fifteen days, spend the time to grind to those alchemy packs because we're going to show you what's inside of an alchemy pack. We're going to show you what's in, what in them because it's a little different than a standard package. Okay. Um, also, guys, just for booting up Arena, if you haven't booted up today, you're going to immediately, I made shorts on these to let people know, you're going to immediately get three packs, and you're going to get some wilds, and you're going to get all the copies of the rebalanced, nerfed, and buffed copies of your cards. So that's just for logging in, you're going to get three. Three packs, uh, a mythic rare, and three rares right off the money, okay? That's number one. Then, you want to click here, guys. Welcome to Alchemy. All you have to do, I already finished this game. I already finished all of them with my Green Inferno. All you have to do is click play one time. Even if you hate Alchemy, even if you're dead set against it, all you have to do is click play and you'll immediately, or join or whatever it is there, you'll immediately get three more packs. Okay? You'll immediately get three more packs. 
So that's six packs on top of that. So that's at least a rare and at least an uncommon. And then if you finish, you'll get 2,000 XP, which is two ranks of your... Um, which is two ranks of your uh, 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 Mastery Pass, and three more packs on top of that. So you're going to get a grand total of nine packs just for being involved with Alchemy. I would have to say that's pretty generous altogether. It's a grand total of, I think, nine, uh, 12, uh, 12 rares or Mythic rares with a bunch of other stuff thrown in there just for being involved at step one. Okay, To me, that's worth it. Even if you decide you hate it, it's worth playing through. It's an introduction to the system. I personally really like it, and I definitely think you should give it a shot, okay? But I feel like Wizards has been pretty generous. The only other thing that I could say, I'll criticize a little bit, is they could have given maybe a few more raw wild cards. If they wanted to really go nuts with it, they could have said, you know what, also, guys, here is a, here is a rare, here's a mythic rare, two regular rares, and three uncommons, free wilds, just in case you feel bad about maybe one of your favorite cards in Historic getting nerfed. Um, they could have done that as well. I don't think, I think it's a little bit much to say we're going to refund all of your Historic cards from nerf. That's, that are nerfed. That's a lot of wilds to refund. That's a, asking a lot. But already with a lot of the things that they have, they've been very, very generous. I, I think that they have been. I think that. I'm not paid by Wizards. I'm not affiliated with Wizards in any way. So before you call me a shill, they have not given me a cent. I don't even think they know they're, uh, 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 I, I exist. So I am not shilling for them. I did no pre-release information. They gave me nothing for this. Hashtag not sponsored. All right? So I want you to know that. I just happen to really like this idea and really like this format. So let's clear that up out of the way. Um, welcome to all the new guys. Um, uh, Maynak, P uh, Puka, Rhyme, how you guys doing? We're getting so many new people here tonight. Um, so let's get to these packs, boys. Uh, how do we want to open it? Let's start with the small ones first. We'll open a banger and then we'll small them out. Uh, I only shill for Liquid Death. As soon as Liquid Death calls me, I'm going to say yes, Daddy. Uh, I love me some Liquid Death. Um, please, nobody click me saying that clip me saying that i'd be really embarrassed if somebody clipped me it's free real estate so let's break into these beautifully crafted packs i really like this uh ability here i like like how these look um all right let's take a look so inside of an alchemy pack you're gonna get oh i already got it you're gonna get the commons are going to be your standard commons from the set vow being the innistrad okay so that's gonna go towards your cachet uh bernie dave how you doing man and then, of course, Rhymewall Protector is going to be your uncommon, your uncommon, and then you're going to get your rare. So these are from the standard set, meaning they're from Innistrad. And then these ones are going to be from this particular set of the alchemy. So what do we got here? Rare Wild. Rare Wild. Rare Wild. Immediately giving me, giving me some love here. And we got the pup. All right. Soul Stealer Axe, Settle the Wilds. Torfall's Discipline, boom, look at that. All right, uh, let's do some more singletons. We'll do one big banger. Uh, we'll get some wilds here. Faithful Discipline, another wild. Ominous Traveler, I got two of these now. This is actually based on me, in case you don't know that. Uh, Angel of Eternal Dawn, falling in love quickly. Falling deeply in love with her. Looking into her eyes and seeing the beauty of the morning. Uh, another rare wild, look at this. I think the... I have a sneaking suspicion that alchemy packs have a higher drop rate of wilds. I don't know if that's true. It's a sneaking suspicion because there's not very many cards to choose from. Fearsome Whelp, that's a good one. Assemble from parts, definitely. Yeah, getting some good stuff. Hey, all she got to do is cosplay it, man. She's got to get some big old feather wings. and uh, There we go. Sanguine Brushstroke. You think I won't put a gain and, gain and drain in my deck? You crazy, bro. Uh, you crazy. All right, so let's keep doing this here. Fearsome Welp, Soul Stealer Axe, Grizzle Hunt Master. Uh, this is so so, so so. Okay, let's keep it going. All right, Tenacious Pup, another one and a rare. Wicker Wing Effigy. I actually like that one. It's a little complicated. It makes burbs, so Council of Burbs should be happy. Brush Strokes is very good, very good. Yeah, if you haven't seen my shorts, go check those out. Uh, about opening alchemy there's another rare wild we're really filling up here guys let's get some mythics another okay so we already know what's up man we already know what's up with ominous traveler they know 
They know. You know. And I know that they know about Ominous Traveler. Angel of Unity, pretty good. I'm happy about her. Um, there's the Mythic Rare Wild. Okay. All right. Another one. All right. Another, well, another Tenacious Pup. We probably got all those. Antique Collector. All right. Filling up here. All right. One more than we're going to do. Ten Banger for you guys. I know how you like to see a Ten Banger. Faithful Discipline, Brutal Blast. Sinister Reflections. Oh, okay. Pretty cool. There's a zombie behind it. Conjure Duplicate. All right. You guys, y'all want a Big Banger? We want a Big Banger, boys? Give me some hype in the chat for that Big Banger right now, guys. Thusla Doom, how you doing? Uh, uh, Dovahkiin, what's up? Dark Sorcerer. Um, yes, Steady, please. All right, here we go. Let's do this big banger. Big banger, big banger. Ooh, look at that. Conductive Current. Uh, ooh, that's a lot of Mythics. This is two Mythics. Another Symbol Farm, Predatory Spudge, Blood Rage Alpha. Arm Scavenger, definitely for our Warriors deck. Um, Thuzla Doom, how you doing, man? Obsessive Collector, okay. Right in my colors, man. Right in my colors. All right, well, we're going to do some singletons here. All right, Cursebound Rich, Faithful Discipline. Lupine Harbingers, yeah, definitely. Doom to Center. And remember, if you've got, if you haven't filled out all your cachet for your commons, do that. And you will absolutely be rewarded for that because uh, this will help fill up your cachet for commons, which is web, soul stealer axe, predatory sludge. We're doing pretty good here. Color marks, man. Uh oh, he's down bad right now. He's down bad like Oko. All right. Rhymewall Protector, we're definitely doing another Giants with that one. Sigardian Evangel, I'm not sure about here. I don't know. Tapping out, it's it's more of a tax card, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to have to wait and see in here. Puppet Razor, definitely. Definitely Puppet Razor is going to be one we're using. I think what I want to build, guys, if you want to uh, if you want to hang around, I think we're going to build a City Stalker Connoisseur. Very good. I think we're going to build a Patient Zero Rakdos. Uh, I think we're going to build a... There's Wicker Wing Estrogy, more Burbs. All right. Uh, Cursebound Witch, another Tenacious Pup. Rahilda, yeah, definitely. We're going to do... Uh, we're going to definitely do another Gruel Werewolf. That's a guarantee right there. And Faithful Discipline, Settle the Wilds. Another Mythic Rare. See, I feel like Wilds might be more frequent, man. I feel like Wilds might be more frequent, man. I've gotten so many Wilds in this one, man. I've, I've totally refreshed my Wild thing. All right, here's the last one. Here's the last one, guys. What we got? What we got? What we got? Another Tenacious Pup. And there we go. Boom. Angel of Eternal Dawn. There she is, boys. There she is, the Angel of Eternal Dawn. Is she the new waifu? I don't know. Uh, let's find out. Let's find out. All right. And we're only one away from getting another wild. So let's go Let's go, uh, Let's go. go nuts for donuts over here, guys. Uh, let's brew a little bit, and then we'll, we'll hang it up. I just wanted to give you this introduction. Uh, we're almost go at the point where we need to buy the uh, Mastery Pass. Um, so let's go build us a deck, guys. I also really do like, don't be shocked at here, they've changed the way this worked, and I think it's a lot more intuitive. You have events, you have uh, casual, and then you have ranked. Oh, it's the last played. This is the ranked, and then you just hit the tabs. So if you want to go to the last plate, you just want to hit this and just keep going back into what you want, then here it's it's a lot easier to understand. It's not that big list. So ranked, play, and brawl. We also have a standard brawl. Did we used to have a standard brawl? I think we only had a historic brawl, didn't we? So uh, you're going to hit ranked. You do alchemy and regular historic. So that's what we're going to look at. So we're going to make we're going to make a deck here. Um, we've had standard brawl. I don't remember having a standard brawl. So let's take a look at a patient zero. Uh, let's take a look at a patient zero one here, guys. Uh, let's take a look at a patient zero. We've got almost a full play set of ominous travelers there. Let's see what we got for new zombie cards, guys. 
We did have it. I don't remember a standard. I always thought it was historic. Uh, let's take a look at this. Alchemy only. And let's take a look at the blacks and the reds. What do we got? All right, not collected. All right, so there's the patient zeros. Now, patient zero, what this does is damage isn't removed from creatures during your opponent's control's cleanup steps. That's horrible, dudes. Zombies will absolutely eat everything. So we're going to load with that one up. Scathe zombies is apparently alchemy because it's also an arena card. Okay, so that's why it's there. Uh, Puppet razor. Hmm. I don't know if we want to include her, but we definitely want all patient zeros. Um, and then we'll do vow. I want to do mono black zombies, maybe. Let's look at a mono black zombos. Maybe not even a Rakdos. Blue is nice, but I've done the blue exploit. I haven't doubled down and just done the full black zombie experience. Uh, so we're going to do that. Headless Rider. Um, who else do we want? We got Patient Zero. I got Headless Rider. Uh, Jadar. That's a good one. Shambling Gas. That's a good one. Um, assemble from parts. That's going to be a good one. Doom Descender is a good uh, sacrificer there. Um, do we want to include some exploit? I don't think we want to include some exploit. White is good. Uh, Arch Ghoul of Throbin. Arch Ghoul of Throbin is pretty decent. Fell Stinger, definitely want that. Um, Book of Vile Darkness, I don't think that that's worth it. And Cemetery Desecrator. He's a little too expensive, man. He's good, but... Uh, Dawn of the Dead vibes? Yeah, very much so. Patient Zero. Love it. Uh, hobbling Zombie. I actually like Hobbling Zombie. It's pretty decent. Uh, and I think we might want to go with a Wipe. I think we might want to do with... Uh, go with... Um, let's do Meat. Let's do meat hook. Do we want to do white? Arch Ghoul Thraven. I don't know if we want Arch Ghoul. Well, maybe. Headless Rider. Assemble from parts. Yeah, well, I'm glad to see you too, Grimy. I'm glad to see you too. Uh, all the new people. I've got to try to start doing more early streams for people. Um that can't always catch me so uh we're probably going to do an hour early stream sometimes just to hang out um jadar run essica oh my god yeah. carl 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 man i got no patience here so i'm gonna have to craft them all i'm gonna have to craft them all shambling doom to center maybe we don't want doom to center White, Arch Ghoul. Let's do one less of those. Um, let's do a crawl from the cellar. And uh, what else can we do here? Do we want a Jadar? We don't want to get all the decayed. Ghoulish Procession, Hobbling Zombie. Glorious Resurrector. Uh, I put Tainted Adversary in there. I mean, why play something original? Butler, you think Butler's good? I haven't even really taken a look at Butler. I don't even think I crafted him. Oh, yeah, he's there. Eh, I'd rather just run uh, Crawl from the Cellar. I'd rather just run Crawl from the Cellar. All right, so we're going to use some of our new rares on Patient Zero here. Um, definitely worth it. Hey, you just made affiliate. Okay, awesome, bro. We'll run one game of uh, this new one, um, of this new deck, and then we're going to leave it because this isn't really a deck video. This is just kind of an intro video. Uh, so let's go to Standard. Uh, let's go to Alchemy. Um... Where is my deck? Where did it go? Why is it not here? I 
Did I not save it? Oh, there it is. Black Death. Let's take a look here. There's my Black Death. Let's give it a shot, boys. Primal Zone. Maybe I'll win, maybe I won't. We'll see. Should have sleeved them up? Yeah, yeah, I should have. I'll keep it. Yeah, I remember when I got that email saying you made affiliate. It was a good feeling, man. Maybe one day I'll make get that email that said I made partner. I don't know though. Um, hmm. I'm gonna have a, I'm gonna have trouble if I don't get a mana. Um. So we have an opportunity here. Hobbling zombie. Let's do arch of Thrabin. Let's swing in. No, we don't want none. So we can meet Hook. Wedding announcement. Okay. Let's try this. Let's build board and see how many we can pop with the massacre. Player class. Vanishing verse, Arch School of Thraven. That's not the one I'd have gone after. Nope. Nope, nope. Um, I don't trust him not to play an instant. Oh, no, he only has Field of Ruin. Yeah, okay. So there's Hobbler. Uh, let's see if he wants to block. He doesn't. I can get him down so far. I could nuke my own things and kill him like that. So he has a vampire. Okay. Okay. Respect. Respect, my dude. Let's do it. See if we can get it in, guys. Champion would have been killed. Luminous Phantom. I know now I'm gonna get the uh I know now I'm gonna get the old uh the old whatchamacallit. I know I'm gonna get the mana. It's 
it's going to flood me. I need the cards, though. Nah, it's not worth it. He could double block. Uh, he wouldn't lose very much. Cigar to Splendor. Three, four, flying. Probably will pop Jadar or somebody. Jadar, champion of the perished. Yeah, he should have popped Jadar. That's the most dangerous one. Because of that. Morbid opportunist. Crawling his way back like a zombie. Mm. Yeah, he's got too much momentum now. He's got too much momentum now, and I'm not getting the card draw that I need. I should have played that meat hook earlier. I was trying to hold on to it. Uh, but I should have meat hooked him earlier and, and started pushing pressure on it. I don't know what I was waiting for. Uh, but I should have pressured him way, 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 way earlier. See, because now I'm all, all I'm going to hit is mana. Guarantee you all I'm going to hit his mana from now on. Yeah, I'm, I'm only going to hit mana from here on out. I know the shuffler well enough to know that after 18 cards, 18 cards, guys, 7 of which are mana. I don't know, man. That's not very good. Uh, 22 mana in this deck, by the way. Yeah, he's building too much booze. Crawl from the cellar. Okay, so let me do that. Uh, let's bring back uh, Fell Stinger. Target one zombie I control. Uh, we could do that one. Let's cast that. Sacrifice. Lose two life. Um, create a treasure token. Draw some cards. And it's all mana. Look at that. So we're going to crawl from the cellar. Uh, let's do Patient Zero now. Hobbling Zombie White. Uh, let's do Champion of the Perished. Let's do that. And of course we can guess that. Beautiful. Beautiful card draw there, guys. Mana City going down. Um... He can probably swing in for the kill here. That's going to be 8, 10. No, not quite yet, but we're still in bad shape. The only thing I'd save is if we draw Meat Hook, we'll be okay. If we draw a Meat Hook, we'll be good, but he is life gaining out the ass right now. Um, didn't get too much special, man, in packs. It was pretty decent, but nothing too crazy. Yeah, if we can Meat Hook, we'll be, we'll be fine. That's the only thing that's going to save us. We have four Meat Hooks, 7% chance. Of meat hooking. But he is way too set up. I should have gone more aggro. I don't know. I was playing conservatively. I guess I wanted to no no yeah. Now now with that bonus, yeah, that's twelve. Uh that's twelve, that's thirteen. Boof, boof, yeah, down to one. Hey, what's up, Amy? And that's gonna be another mana naturally. Alright, good game. Didn't go didn't go aggressively enough. Either way, um do you know what guys? 
look at that. Here, here's the thing, and this is what I want to say. Look at that deck. That was a beautifully constructed deck that that guy had. Has anybody seen something like that in Standard before? Orzhov Super Friends or something like that? I haven't. A life gain, uh, a life gain Orzhov Super Friends type thing. Um. Uh. It's new. It's new, guys, and I had to adapt to the same thing. It wasn't Mono White Exile. It wasn't fucking Is It Turns. It wasn't Essica. It was a new deck. And did you see how engaged I was trying to think about it? What could happen next? There is new and exciting things going on. Um, there is new things happening. There is more expansions. I'm not even that man I lost, man. Because that was a fun deck that gave me ideas. I said, oh, wow, really doubling down on the Orzhov life gain. Man, what if what if I did that, but instead, what if I put in um, uh, that uh, Witness one, whatever that guy is? Um, you know, what if I did that? What if I built off of that one? Very, very interesting stuff. You're not running into the same thing over and over again. And I didn't see that much effect of the buffs and nerfs other than it expanded the meta playing field. Uh, before, because it was just a sea of is it turns. Before two weeks ago, it was just as is it turns as far as the eye can see. So yeah, we have buffs and nerfs, and yeah, not everyone's happy about them. But being able to play against opponents who are running new and interesting things that you have to adapt to, that is worth it. That is worth it. Um, so that's definitely worth it for getting into alchemy because I'm not even mad I lost. I'm not even mad I lost. And I get so frustrated before losing to the same deck over and over and over again and just not seeing anything new. So I think it's healthy for the meta. I think it's healthy for MTG Arena. It's been a really good day um, overall. I've been enjoying myself. Um, and uh, we're going to leave it there, guys. We're done streaming for today. We're going to be back tonight. We're going to release this video tomorrow with the pack opening and everything else. We're going to do more previews. Keep an eye out for more alchemy. Keep it tuned here. I'm glad all the new people could come in. Um, if you're not on my YouTube yet, why aren't you there? Um, if you're not on my Discord, if you haven't liked the videos yet, you're going to get attacked by a werewolf. It's going to happen, guys. I'm sorry. Um, until next time, boys. I've been Jay Villain, and you've been great. The word of the day is alchemy. Bye-bye, everybody. Adios.